You guys have a really tough schedule coming up. I mean, you just played, I think, four games in 12 days. Now you have five games in 15 days. So add, add another game onto that. How do you manage that? Yeah, I think we have a deep squad, uh, and we've shown that with Open Cup and the games that we've had this past couple months. Uh, everyone's ready to step in. Uh, case in point, Marvin uh, stepping in in that game against Houston, scoring a big goal to open up the game for us. I think that shows uh, what our team's about, and we're going to approach the games the same way coming forward. Uh, as someone who's been in this lineup, obviously you've, you've been uh, consistently getting minutes. Uh, what do you see as your sort of role in, within the group, especially when you're navigating uh, a difficult schedule? Yeah, I think, again, individual, as individuals, it's about being ready when your number's called on. Now, I know I've been involved the last uh, several games with the team, but you know there's going to be other guys that are going to have to step in as well, and, and it's about being ready for my opportunity when it when it keeps on coming, uh, and in, in different positions as well. Uh, I started off as a striker this year and moved out to the wing, and, and I've been starting to be more comfortable out there. So again, whatever the coaching staff needs out of all of us, we're all ready and together. What have you been able to do to transition to, to more of a wide position? And you said you're starting to feel more comfortable. Um, how it has, how's that ability to feel comfortable grown? Yeah, the hardest part was definitely the relationship with the outside back, uh, knowing when to stay wide and let him use the inside space and come inside and let him overlap. Uh, and I think Jorge and I have, have developed a good one there. Uh, unfortunately, he's out injured, but I'm sure it'll continue with whoever's out there if I'm out wide. Uh, and then also just being in the right attacking spaces, uh, trying to get good crosses into the box to, for service to Valeri and Brian and, and late runners coming in. So, uh, And then chipping in the goals as well when I can. Does it change sort of how you play that position as someone who is used to also playing a striker? It isn't can be wide, but also can maybe come in and into the box and be that a uh, target to look for? Definitely. I, I think, you know, I've transitioned almost to a target in a more wide area for the team uh, where I'm linking up the play there and, and helping advance the ball in the attack. Uh, and then obviously I like to try and get in the box as well and trying to get on the end of crosses and, and help uh, myself and others get on the score sheet. And then specifically looking ahead to this game uh, against New York, obviously you're balancing a, a tough schedule after that, but um, long travel, uh, known kind of as a, as a more narrow field. What, what are sort of the keys for you guys to be able to go there and get a result? Yeah, I remember my, my first trip to New York in 2017. We got a result there. Uh, we came in and imposed ourselves, uh, weathered their storm a little bit. But uh, that's always going to happen when you're playing away. You're going to have to manage different, different moments in the game. Uh, so I think it's going to be important for us to, to go out there and play our game, uh, try to get on the score sheet early, and then manage the game as best we can.